Hi, I am uh, Dr. Vikas Tatton. I am a consultant spine surgeon at uh, Indian Spine Energy Center and I've been working here since 2007. It's almost going to be 16 years now since I've been working here as a consultant spine surgeon. Okay, I'm going to speak on uh, tuberculosis of spine. Uh, as we all know that tuberculosis is, a, is one of the most common infectious diseases in India and uh, it's rampant in India and uh, when it comes to bone and uh, spine, the spinal tuberculosis is the most common form of tuberculosis which comes to any orthopedic or spine surgeon. Uh, when it happens in spine, what happens is it starts eating away the bone and it can produce a lot of pus. So initial symptoms may include uh, a lot of back pain, especially in the night cries, patient may have a lot of pain while sleeping, it becomes difficult for the patient to sleep. If there is a lot of pus and if it starts pressing on the bone, the patient can present with weakness in the legs or arms depending on the level of involvement of the vertebrae with the tuberculosis. Uh, yes, tuberculosis is a medical problem. Mostly the patient, patient requires treatment with medical medicine that includes anti-tubercular treatment. But sometimes we need to go and operate such patients like if the patient has weakness in the legs or he presents with a neurological deficit or in a later scenario when the patient comes with a heel tuberculosis but with a deformity of spine we may have to correct that so basically tuberculosis is a is, is a is a bad infection for spine which can give a lot of trouble to patients though it being a medical problem but surgery is important sometimes and is required thank you